Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. So right now I am getting dressed and getting ready to go ahead and view this apartment at 2 o'clock. It is currently 12.58. You guys can see 12.58. And yeah, I'm just doing my hair. I'm going to view this apartment that I've been wanting to view for a long time. Um, if you guys don't know, my lease is up in August of this year. So I just want to just have options and just look around before I just choose one spot. I did view a different apartment like a year or two ago that I really still love. But I feel like I just need a couple more options before I just settle on something. Because I don't want to be unsatisfied. So, yes, I'm about to go view this apartment. And I think today I'm just going to do like a sleek bun with my hair. Um, nothing too crazy because it is just a really lazy day for me. And it's just really gloomy out and cold. So, yeah, I'm just going to do like... Just a cute little sleek bun with some baby hairs and just try to get myself together. Um, but anyways, yeah, so that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just going to go ahead and put my hair up and get myself together. Um, I definitely feel like this year is a year of reaching goals and achieving what you want and not settling for less. Um, I feel like this apartment that I'm about to go view, it is, it's beautiful. Like, it is so gorgeous. And I know for a fact that I can have, that I will have. An apartment like this and then I will be able to move into this apartment this year so I'm just reaching my goals this year is all about like winning and reaching goals so that's what I'm really focusing on this year and trying to just you know take it step by step but um yeah anyways I'm gonna go ahead and do my hair get cute get some clothes on and then I will just see you guys after I am done so this is my hairstyle for today. I just put it like in like this middle part and then I have like my clip in my hair and I just kind of like let my hair fall over it. I didn't put anything in my hair. I just brushed it out, put some water in it and then left it poofy because I feel like it's super cute like that. But I'm just brushing out my lashes and then I'm about to go ahead and pick out some of my perfume for the day. So yeah and I also don't know if I want to put a jacket on or if I just want to wear my coat because I'm not really going anywhere. Um... But yeah, I feel like I have a lash in my eye. Okay, so I had a lash in my eye. It hurts so bad. But um, yeah, I'm about to go ahead and head over to this apartment building and see what's going on. I feel like my, um, my camera's dirty. I don't know. I also need to go get a tripod. I think my thing just died. It did. But I also have to go to Best Buy today to get a tripod, so I'm going to be doing that as well. But anyways, yeah, I will see you guys once I get to the apartment. If she lets me record, then I'll try to record for you guys. But if not, then I'm sorry. But I really want to show you guys this apartment. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and head out, and I will see you guys later. So I just wanted to show you guys. I set up this little cute thing on the back of my toilet. It's so cute um, with all my different perfumes, and I have some little essentials going there but for today's perfume i'm definitely going to be using the k ali vanilla 28 so i'm going to go ahead and spray some of this on and i'm going to mix it with something else but i don't know what yet so yeah this is my perfume of the day so here's the building you guys super cute right love the marble this is actually where i took some of my instagram pictures before super cute so i'm here just waiting for the realtor um it's super cute in here you guys so cute chandelier they have all these like pictures going down the hallway let me see if i can show you guys super cute so yeah just here waiting for her it's a really cool unit yeah i seen it and i was like it's so beautiful and it's it so really spacious is. it's so pretty <laughs> All of our apartments in this building have barrier-free showers, except like the one upstairs is yeah. the glass door. But most of them have the the barrier-free, which is nice. Oh you yeah, a big door. And I like <laughs> the light on top of the shower. I don't have that, so I'm like, oh my gosh, I yeah, love it so much. Yeah, nice. I agree. I agree. You probably want all these lights on before you get up. There's reading lights above your bed on both sides. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> awesome. All right, come on in. So this is your kitchen area, Cambria quartz countertops, which are 
the best of the best. Mm -hmm. um, self closing cupboards, which is nice. <laughs> nice for luggage and things like that. Yeah. You know, in her daughter's case, some of her, you know, some of her things can be here something. Yeah. I'm just going to keep putting lights on I love the lights up here. So cute. But yeah, it's my second job. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. That's nice. So this is the bedroom upstairs. And again, it's got the reading lights above Yeah, the I love that. And then this is a cool little room. It can be an office or a workout room. Yeah. Or, you know, whatever. I love it so much. <laughs> and then you've got these pretty barn doors. Yeah. You can if you want to. Oh, so pretty. <laughs> this is really a fun unit. It really is. <laughs> <laughs> Has there been a lot of people that have been in this apartment? I showed it twice yesterday. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I don't really know. I got good feedback from them, but yeah. I don't. You know, I don't. I don't have anybody for a firm yet. Yeah. So it's still available. Toys or whatever. Oh too, yeah. But that would always work that way too. Yeah. Um, it's important to have as much natural light as you can get, and then if you can't, you know, we're putting in as much of condensed lights as we can. In. So I am back home, and I just wanted to say I love the apartment. I'm obsessed, and um, I really wanted to come out here to talk to you guys about just manifesting the life you want and going after the goals that you want to go after. I never thought that I would be able to make YouTube videos or be saying that YouTube is my second job, and I'm just so blessed to have everyone who does watch me and who does support me no matter what I upload, no matter what I do. I just want to say thank you guys so much because I didn't even get on here and say thank you guys for 5k. I think I might have. I'm not sure. I think I made a post, but I didn't talk about it in my video. Like, I remember the day I hit a thousand subscribers. I was so excited, you guys, and now I'm at 5,000 and I know I'm on my way to 100k. So, with that being said, you guys can do anything that you want to do as long as you put your mind to it and keep doing it keep doing it don't give up there are many times where i feel like i'm not good enough or this video is not going to hit like i want it to hit or i'm not going to reach my subscribers i'm not going to be able to reach my goals that i want to reach um, but at the end of the day i am like i'm going to and i know for a fact that god has amazing plans for me and amazing things are going to happen this year in my life so you know i just want to get on here and share some positivity with you guys and after viewing this apartment i'm like I was going to settle on another apartment, but I'm like, excuse me, is settle? We don't settle over here, baby girl. So after seeing this, I was like, this apartment is definitely where I'm going to be. I don't know for sure yet if I'm going to fully agree on moving into this apartment or signing a lease yet because I still want to view a couple other apartments and get some other options, but it definitely gave me the motivation that I need just being in a beautiful home like that and saying that that's my home, like, oh my gosh, it's it's I don't even know how to explain it but yes so I just want to say you guys can do whatever you want to do in life put your mind to it pray believe that God will bring it to you and he will in the right time so yes I am at home I'm waiting for the baby to wake up it is 2 24 and speaking of which I do have my vision board on my phone as my screen so these are all the goals that I want to accomplish all the things that I want to do all the people I look up to um, who inspire me to be a better person and to motivate me into reaching my goals and, you know, doing what I got to do to hit every single goal that I want to hit this year. Um, but anyways, yes, I'm waiting for the baby to wake up and then I'm going to go over to Best Buy because I need to buy a tripod for my camera. I accidentally bought two of them on Amazon a while ago when I first got my camera. It was like two years ago. Um, so I don't know where they are. One of them broke and then the other one, I think I accidentally um, threw it away when I was my mom was cleaning up my car when I got in the car accident so I have to go find another tripod um, so yeah that's what I'm doing now just sitting here waiting for the baby to wake up and oh my gosh you guys I'm just so ex I'm just so inspired you know what I mean so anyways yes I definitely had a good time the lady is so sweet so amazing she answered every question that I had she's so nice she's just so Oh, I don't know. I just had a really great time. So that was the first time I've ever had a really good apartment showing. Like she was phenomenal. Like she, she's so sweet, and I feel like she just, she knows exactly what to say to get you. But anyways, um, yes, 
I'm gonna go ahead and wait for the baby to wake up and then I will see you guys at Best Buy and then I also want to go at Starbucks so yeah what's a vlog without Starbucks here we get I'm just kidding <laughs> okay anyways I was about to talk the peace sign y'all we're out of here we're out of here all right so whoo. so we are at Best Buy I am trying to find a tripod they have this one which I've had before but I really don't want to get this one again and then I've seen that they had this one but I really don't need the ring light so I'm not sure which one I want to get and then they have another one they have all these little like kits down here but then they also have these ones too I wish they had one in black but um yeah so I don't know which one I want to get yet they did not have a tripod that I wanted so I'm just gonna order it online um, but I was also like, well, why am I getting a new tripod when I think I want to get a new camera? So I was looking in there and I see that they had the Sony ZV-1. I want that one. I don't know for sure if I want, I'm like stuck between that one or the Canon G7X. So I don't know. I really like the tripod that comes with the Sony. It doesn't come with the Sony, but it's like the little, um, handheld it has like buttons on it or whatever. And it's a tripod. I love it. It's so cute. It's so aesthetic. And I don't know, I just have to see like the difference, like the quality between each camera before I choose. But I definitely feel like I want a different camera. So anyways, I'm about to head over to Starbucks and go get me a coffee. I got my Starbies. So excited. Haven't had any Starbucks in like two days, you guys. <laughs> anyways, yeah, so I did try this new drink today. It's really good. I just made reservations for lunch. Um, I'm actually here at the restaurant. It's downtown, so I just had to walk a couple of buildings down. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get me something to eat, you guys. I'm starving. I haven't ate all day yesterday and I did not eat today yet. And it's already 11, it is 11.20. So yeah, I made reservations for 11.30. So I'm gonna go ahead and get in here. And I'm sorry if the quality is not as good. I am recording off of my camera. I mean, I am recording off of my phone. So yeah, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and get me something to eat. And I will catch you guys in a second. Honey, Hey babes, so I just did a little bit of shopping. I had my lunch. It is 1.58 and I'm just now getting back home. I had to do some shopping, you guys. So anyways, the first, I'm just going to show you guys everything that I got. Um, so yeah, anyways, the first thing I'm going to show you guys is this little cake I got. I've been wanting some of this cake for so long, but they never have individual pieces and I'm not trying to buy a whole cake because it's just me and the baby. So it's just going to be like all this extra cake and then I have to eat so much. But anyways, I got some cake slices of my favorite cake. It looks like this. Can we just take a second to appreciate the cake? Like I got two slices of this wonderful cake. It is so delicious. This is the almond poppy seed with vanilla cream in the middle cake. Oh my gosh, y'all. Is so good it's fire okay so yeah that's the first thing I picked up and I had to get two of them because it was the last two and they never have these out they only sell them by the cake like the whole entire cake but anyways that's the first thing I picked up the second thing that I picked up I did stop at the mall to get me some shoes I've been wanting these shoes for so long and I did not want to wait for them or pay for shipping so I went in the mall and it so happens that they had them today so yes I got these converse y'all oh my gosh they are so cute i love them i love them so much i'm so obsessed with them you guys like i just cannot get over them they're so freaking cute so yeah i did go ahead and pick up these i love them so that's the next thing i picked up and then i did go to h&m what's h&m and i just grabbed one thing from there i needed some new leggings so i just grabbed just some black leggings nothing special but y'all, the real tea is I went to this store called City Trends and I don't know if you guys have one where you live, but it's basically like a off-brand Burlington, off-brand Marshalls kind of type thing and they sell a lot of like cheap clothes, cheap body products. Y'all, I found so many good Dove hygiene products in here. I am not even lying to you when I say I found 
so many good Dove products. So I'm going to show you guys everything that I picked up because this stuff bangs. Okay. So anyways, um, this is the um, Pistachio Cream in Magnolia um, Shower Gel. So it looks like this. And I was actually going to buy this off of Amazon, but I was like, um, let me just see if they have it in the store. And you guys, they so happen to have it. So, yes, this is what it looks like. Oh my gosh, I am obsessed. I was so happy when they had this. It smells so, so good, you guys. It smells so good. So that's the first one I picked up. The second one I picked up is this Dove Go Fresh. Um, this is the Renew Nourishing Body Wash in Raspberry and Lime Scent. I haven't seen this one either. So when I seen this, when I seen all of them really, I was just like, you know what? Go ahead and pick them up because you do not have them. And this was $5.99 for this. This huge bottle. I'm going to smell it. I haven't smelled any of these. I just grabbed them. Oh my gosh. That one smells really good. It smells like pink, like, um, pink lemonade. And then this one was $4.99 for this big bottle. This is like one of the bigger bottles than the regular ones. Um, I don't really know how to explain it, but yeah, it's just like a bigger version of the regular bottle. And then the next one I got is this Rebalancing Dove Go Fresh Body Wash with White Peach and White Tea. So this is a huge bottle. And this one was $7.49. Even has the pump. And I actually am going to go ahead and smell this because I did not smell this. Let me see. Oh yeah, that one, I know I'm going to love it. Oh my gosh, so obsessed. And then this next one I got is this Go Fresh Energized Body Wash with Grapefruit and Lemongrass. So that's what that one looks like. Never seen this one before either. And it was $7.49. Ooh, that one smells so good, you guys. It smells so clean. I love it. And then the last one I got is this Relaxing Care Nourishing Body Wash with Almond Cream and Hibiscus. So it looks like this. And then this one was $5.99. Let me smell it. Ooh, yep. I love that one. That one smells so good. Uh, my mom actually told me to go here because she had all of these different um, Dove body washes that I've never seen before and I'm like where did you get these from and she's like well go to City Trends girl I'm gonna get you healed anyways um the last thing I got not really the last thing I have one thing after this but the next thing I got is this cute little pajamas for the baby you guys isn't this so cute it has frozen on there I thought these little um dresses like gowns are so cute on her I just love it so I had to pick her up another one of these love it it's so cute and then I did make a stop to pick up some wine. And this was my first time trying this wine. Um, this is the Jam Jar Sweet Shiraz 2020 wine. Looks like this. Um, it says it's packed with juicy berry flavors and hints of dark chocolate. Jam Jar makes a versatile partner for everything from cheeseburgers to chocolate pudding. Period. Because I love, love, love drinking wine when I'm eating. So... Oh, I can't wait to try this. I've seen this on the Glam Twins channel, and they inspired me to pick this up. I am a sucker for red wine. Sweet red wine is my favorite, especially when I'm eating. So, yes, I did go ahead and pick up this. 